Good morning. 3.38, a little later start today. But one thing I wanted to say this morning was I'm going green tea with some apple cider vinegar instead of a keto coffee. I want to make sure that I'm burning um, the carbohydrate intake that I consumed yesterday for my workout today. So if I were to consume a keto coffee, I think that fat would take over from my fuel source. Um, and then burn that for the workout instead of the carbohydrate into it, bleh, carbohydrate intake. So no keto coffee. I'm gonna wait till after the workout to consume my fats. Um, I'll uh, hit you guys back when we get to the gym. See ya. What up, dude? So the other day I said that whole little rant about pre-workout, and then I got some questions as regarding of of what actual type of pre-workout is, is good, and, and then also some questions on uh, some like ketogenic pre-workout, fasting pre-workout, there's a bunch of questions regarding this. So I'll just tell you, when I do take pre-workout, I do it in like bulk supplement form. So I have like each individual actual ingredient that's usually found in a lot of pre-workouts, and I just make this, so I, I totally exclude you know, a lot of the artificial stuff that comes within the pre-workouts and, um, and a lot of the stuff that will actually break a fast. So I have just straight L-carnitine, beta-alanine, citrulline malate, and creatine monohydrate. And um, I also have a caffeine pill, and then I'll throw some pink salt in a blender and just blend, uh, just blend all this stuff up and then just, just chug it down. I, I mix today's. So I mix today's in water, um, but I usually will mix it in like green tea and then put a, a, a splash of stevia in there, just for taste purposes. This is gonna taste absolutely terrible, but um, you know, it, I mean, it does the job. So today's gonna be a heavy, heavy leg circuit day, so might as well, you know, do it on this day. So gonna chug this, hit to the gym. We'll see you when we get there. Peace. Yo, what up? Just got done at the gym, sat in the sauna for 13 minutes. As you saw, had a very successful, well, I guess that's a pretty broad term and it's a matter of opinion, but in my opinion, I had a successful lower body workout, PR'd in uh, sumo deadlifts. Um, so I thought that was pretty cool. Uh, I feel pretty good. The one thing that I would notice about yesterday's carb meal was that, uh, I guess I would say I had energy. Energy was good, but um, on the negative side, like I am starving, uh, and I and I usually don't I usually don't get hungry, you know, until later in the day because I'm usually running off fat. But I'm starving. But right now I'm gonna I'm gonna head to the store. I mean that's it's a routine. So we'll find we'll find out what I can pick up today. So we'll see you back at the house. What up guys, just got back to the apartment. Check this out. Bill Tong Jerky just sent me some samples. Original and garlic. Definitely can't wait to try that out. That's gonna be dope. Um, so we're gonna make a bulletproof coffee, keto coffee if you will. I just wanna introduce fats back into uh, my system and that's a obviously high fat content. So we're gonna do that and then probably an hour after that we'll, we'll consume a high fat meal. So stay tuned for that and, uh, and I didn't really get anything from the grocery store. Actually, pink salt. 
and my roommate wanted, I can't believe it's not butter, light version, <laughs> lean. <laughs> can't wait till he watches that. All right, we'll see you guys in a bit. Hey guys, so I'm making a smoothie and uh, I don't know how it's gonna turn out. I put a little bit of melted butter, mel melted coconut oil, MCT oil, half a scoop of chocolate protein, um, coconut milk, like four blueberries and like four blackberries. And I'm contemplating on putting like a half an avocado, but I think that would dominate the taste. So I'm gonna hold off on the half avocado on the smoothie, and I'm gonna save that for the egg yolk omelet that I'm about to make with this delicious bacon over here in the background. So we're gonna make this, and uh, I'll show it to you afterwards. All right, wish me luck. Oh, hey again. So these are the, the egg yolk. It's gonna be an egg yolk omelet. I'm cooking it in the bacon grease. There's the bacon grease. I ended up putting uh, half of avocado in the in that smoothie, so we'll see how that turns out. See how that turns out. We already know that's gonna be good. I'm gonna throw a little bit of turmeric in the egg yolk, and then also some salt. All right, dudes and dudettes, check it out. We got bacon, egg yolks with some turmeric, and avocado with some pink salt, and then this smoothie. Well, we're gonna see how it tastes, because it looks amazing, and I'm sure it's gonna taste amazing. Not bragging, but let's dive in. We'll hit you up after, tell you what's going on for the rest of the day. Peace. What's up, just woke up from a nap. I feel great. Uh, gonna get a coffee going right now. Neuro Roast Coffee, it's one of my favorites right now. Um, definitely thanks to them for sending me that. So just a, a typical bulletproof coffee, one tablespoon of Kerrygold butter, tablespoon of MCT oil. Um, I threw some collagen peptides in there and like a dash of cinnamon. So we're gonna drink this, get some work done on the computer. Actually, drink this, I'm gonna go for a walk first, then get some stuff done on the computer, and then practice my dance moves. Kidding, and then go throw probably. See ya. What up dudes? Just got back from the walk. Gonna head to the park right now, get some throwing in, and um, come back here, eat, uh, eat an early dinner, and then um, probably call it a night. So, we'll, uh, I'll show you some of the throwing for today, so stay tuned. Hey, what's up guys here at the park still just got done throwing gonna do some running I'm not a big long distance running guy, so I'm gonna do some gassers. So it's about um, I want to say 30 yards down 30 yards back and then 30 yards down 30 yards back um, Probably do about six of them. I'm not gonna show you this time because I felt bad last time you're probably bored So I'm gonna hit that and then we're gonna get out of here. Let's go Man those things are freaking tough I'm not out of shape. <laughs> All right, we just got done. It's about 2.30. We're gonna head home. We're gonna grill a steak, and then we're gonna go to the fitness center and uh, you know, get an excuse to, to watch a game on the TV. We don't have cable at the apartment, so I go to the fitness center to watch my, my games. Okay, we'll see you after this uh, drive home, and um, you'll see this monster rib I'm, I'm about to grill up, so see you. Okay guys, we're gonna throw this nice little ribeye right there and let her cook a good. Close her up. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and crush this. Okay guys, that's gonna do it for today. It's about four o'clock. Um, high intensity training this morning, the lower body, and then a solid nap, some good nutrition, up the fats, had uh, I guess I had a few carbohydrates today in the smoothie feel good energy levels good um, I'm actually gonna go to the fitness center right now do some arm care some mobility work and then shut it down for the day make sure I get some good sleep and, uh, and hit it again tomorrow tomorrow's workouts gonna be upper body 
So it's gonna be high intensity again, so we gotta prepare for that. So appreciate y'all for watching this vlog. If you haven't already, please subscribe to this YouTube channel. Tell your friends, tell your family, tell anyone you can. I really appreciate it. You can follow me on Instagram, RobbieRow12, that's Robbie with a Y. Thank you all for watching and God bless. Have a great rest of your night and we'll see you tomorrow. Enjoy.